I can tell where your scars are just by the way you walk. And every assault that you have endured has ensured your every step. And you are blessed regardless of the animals that have attacked you. And you are pure, no matter who is abused, you are not an angel, you will not see one. And when our kingdom come, it will be you, I, and the Son. We will be one, we will create children, and our children will create us. And every night, by the light of the moon, I will kiss with your scars to have you living to me. I will drink perfume that tastes like you out of a vessel with a waist like you. Then I will draw our bath water warm so and soak till our souls will be born. And we will be safe and secure in my arms. And it will always be this way. See, I can tell where your scars are just by the way you smell. And every night I will walk a mile in your shoes, kiss away your tears and compile your blues. So we choose to get sexy with Robert Johnson and Bessie Smith. And I will lick every bit from your soul's revelation to your pain's exodus. And when there's nothing left to sit, I'll massage the tension from your nakedness and then lift your nose after this way to slowly ride all your pain away. And since I've been calling, I haven't written a lyric. I mean, why should I not call upon spirits with rhythms and flows that dance like Africans who slave on rubber plantations in the Belgian Congo? Whose souls blaze more brilliant than Leopold's? And even tonight's new graves go cold and chlorofluorocarbons warm up the globe, they live like that deep ass John Carpenter flick. I mean, can we agree that the Arisha is still prairie at Santeria? Can we agree that Bordeaux has made itself at home in the Catholic Church and so that when you see me amongst the leaves, I'm thinking I'm praying to the trees, I'm praying through the trees. Like this poetry is now praying through me. See, I am a vessel like the good ship Jesus. I float in the direction which the actual Son of Man teaches. See, death is like a prison full of souls and have to surrender, but the inmates can still make things happen through the outside, be able to propagate their agenda and tree roots, constellations, rivers, streams, these are the evidence of things not seen. Think the Haitian Revolution was Tucson and Desilene. No, that was the evidence of things not seen. They say superstition is the name that the ignorant get to their ignorance. There must be a lot of superstition going around because cash has a spiritual significance with pyramids and acacia trees and signs and symbols of deities taken from my keeper on libraries and now permanently stored in the back. Who am I? I'll be your operator. Patching went to the infinite. If sex and death would be intimate, yet never reaching a climax. Counting millenniums like days since it's finding my destiny for stars like runaway slaves. You can trace my existence through drawings on caves. Yet we submit to the same God. My job to make you conscious of your subconscious. Bring you two new trans dance. Every time your mind get aligned with parallel galaxies, that the Pharisees can barely see, prepared to be taken to the ultimate destiny. We your test will be to call me and he should be worshipped. But instead, you're surrounded by a perfect surface of clowns. And worthless is a balance because purpose isn't found among cheap talking, overpriced drinks and men who think that money is the answer but lack the capital to pay you attention, pay you a compliment, and even wait for you to ask a question. It's typical aggression. Press up and connect them with the temple that they lack the capacity to understand. Like a pre programmed barbarian at the gate, they can't wait for the opportunity to rush your altar and obtain the holiest of holies. At first, he had you with a swagger, but every second that he talked, he slowly fucked it up. <laughs> and I don't know if I believe in fate or soulmates, but I definitely believe in magnetism. And if he can't match your rhythm and the oscillations of this pendulum, should probably swing someplace else in his group. Maybe he should start out at a storefront church. He is beneath your cathedral. He needs to learn to perfect the quality of his service, especially if he can't understand that you should be worshipped. Worshipped. Like an icon. Like a monolithic pylon surrounded by iron columns and marble floors. Because you deserve more than some jerk sitting next to the ball talking about he misplaced his number. Can you borrow yours? <laughs> Or sitting there flash your money, ask me what would happen if he stuffed your pockets with 20s, trying to entice you with a resource of which you had plenty, and if you had any interest that was diminished by the quality of his verses, what type of maniac doesn't understand that you should be worshipped? Worshipped. But instead, he's looking at your skirt with lust. And, and classless men turn women into mind readers, and still some women believe that they can change him. Fix him, train him to get on his knees and meditate on him like a religion, give him the opportunity to fill your chapel with hymns in the chorus, hoping he arrives to the occasion 14 times like Horace his father, but why bother to try to change a group into a priest of his level of exegesis will never be venerable. Will never be memorable. He lacks the level of levity 
necessary to levitate your bacilla above the surface. And until you begin to perceive men's energy, you'll never see the degree of spirituality with which you could be 